I don't really believe in coincidence. So who the fuck are you? Shoot that guy in the ass. Drop it. How the hell are you still standing, man? Shot me in my wallet, put a hole in my brand new Billy Finns. I'll tell you what. How about I give you an IOU on your fancy pants and we just call this a misunderstanding, cool? I don't like to usually make assumptions in my line of work, but uh, you're not Anton Bagdanov, are you? That's not Anton over there. Oh, this? No, 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 no. This over here is Ivan. They're Bratva. And you're out of questions. Hey, hold on, hold on. I can help you track him. See, I'm looking for the Bratva, too. Here's what we're gonna do. I saw you turn that thing on. Pick it up, give it to me, without the ninja shit, and I won't blow your fucking head off. Broke it on purpose, didn't you? Just to be a dick. Look, I already tracked him. Says they're working at Pier 13. Oh, Pier 13? Mm-hmm. You wouldn't be fucking with me, would you? Because if you are, you're gonna have a little road time with Ivan the Terrible over there. That's what it says, man. One three. One three, huh? Guys, I found a link. Definitely Bratva. But there was a complication. What kind of complication? About six feet tall, Chinese, wears a designer suit when he's out murdering people. Yeah. It sounds like you stepped in a big old pile of organized crime drama. Well, it could be a shoe hitman. Hitman sounds about right, but I don't think he's shoe. I gave him the slip, but he's after the same people we are. You couldn't get him to work with us? The dude is insane. Ah, sanity's never been a prerequisite. I'm headed back to the hacker space. Let's see what we can dig up with the new info. How's DedSec taking the new Dawn victory? Eating it up. Protests are going full force across the country, and people who aren't even associated are standing next to us. Couldn't have gone better. Well, not unless the church shut down completely. <laughs> we'll keep pushing until it does. With Miranda and Jimmy Siska on the front lines, New Dawn's taking a huge hit. Hey, you know how many times the average person shits a day? This is a long-winded joke that ends with home data dump, isn't it? Listen to some of these categories. Pre-30s heart attack, undiagnosed diabetic, two weeks pregnant? I'm never buying an internet-accessible camera ever again. Good luck with that. I hope you don't like cell phones. Or TVs. Or sex toys. And not my sex toys, too. Why did they have to ruin everything? Marcus, I need your help. Sure, man. What is it? I picked up a rash or something from Swelter Skelter. I've noodled it, and of course, Dr. Noodle's telling me it's ovarian cancer or something equally horrifying, but I wanted to get a second opinion on it. <clears throat> I, I think maybe somebody else in the group could help you with that. Come on, Josh would just share it with everybody, and there's no way Satara's gonna look under there. Nope. This is the nope situation. Some friend you are. What do you think Dushan's up to? I mean, this guy's working Silicon Valley, no doubt. But he's up against a shitload of smart. <laughs> Does he honestly think he's the smartest guy in the room? 
Hell yeah, he does. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy taking that smug fuck down. <laughs> yeah, me too. We've gotta go back. Where? The Rock, man! This time, you be the prison guards, and I'll be the madman fleeing for his life. <laughs> that sounds way more exciting than what actually happened. You'll have to deal with the park rangers, though. I can't go near him. I break out in hives. Oddly specific allergy you got there. Don't wipe your ass with poison ivy, Marcus. The pain may fade, but it never truly goes away.